Good morning, people. It is. I don't even know what time it is. Y'all look crusty and dusty. Not y'all per se, but my camera. <laughs> okay, so it is 10 12 in the morning, and I so have plans to clean up and do this whole little thing that I have to do today. I have a list of things that I have to do today. Especially since we're on quarantine, I'm like, we might as well get it done. Or I might as well get it done, rather. Because once quarantine over, baby, it's a wrap. Okay? I'm going to be somewhere. I don't know where, but I'm going to be somewhere. So, I just got to eat my breakfast. Now, I'm trying to get down this juice. Everybody, y'all know I done started juicing. I fell off last week. I just, I just fell off. So, I decided that this weekend I'm going to get back on. So, I am juicing strawberries, raspberries, and a pear. And, um, I'm finna get ready to throw on a cute little sweater so I may run to the grocery store right quick. I need to go to two stores. So, I'm going to run and go take care of that real quick. Because I need, we need to get some more toilet paper and I need some more fruits. If I'm going to be locked in this house and I have to juice... I need to get some more fruits and vegetables. So that's what I'm going to get ready to do with me and my daughter. But this is what I'm looking like. My hair is in a mohawk. But what is the point of styling your hair into these cute different styles and you in the house? I'm not doing it. Okay. This is what y'all getting. This little side ponytail. Like I'm 10 years old. This is what y'all are getting. Um, But yeah, I'm going to go to the store. And when we come back, I'm going to go. We're going to start with my room and i have a bunch of snacks now my room is not junky i literally have a bunch of snacks so you are like hey why are the snacks in your room not because i'm greedy but because my kids are and I, if i leave these snacks in the kitchen these snacks will literally and i'm not even exaggerating this is over like over like a hundred and some dollars worth of snacks if i leave them in my room i mean if i leave them in the kitchen they'll be gone within a week this way I can monitor it. Don't go come in here and get three, four bags of chips. Get one bag. Because this mess has to last. Because we don't know what's going to happen in the next couple of days. We don't know. Right now I'm employed with my job. But we don't know if they're going to decide to say, hey, let's shut it down until this clears out. And then we don't have food because y'all done ran through it. No, 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 no. I'm not that parent. Some parents be like, oh, it's just food. Let them do what they want to do. No, boo. We're in survival mode. Okay. And we're going to survive around here. Okay. So, with that being said, the snacks are in my room. They come and get them a snack and they go about their business. I also have board games. Me and my son, we were playing Hungry Hippo yesterday as well as Connect Four. So, today we're going to bring out the Monopoly after we clean up and everything looks good and sanitized. Um, but yeah, child. I got how many cases of water? One, two, three, four, five, six. I got one downstairs, seven. One in my car, eight. So, I'll probably pick up two more cases. Cause you can't never have enough water. I don't give a damn if it if you're not being quarantined. I normally keep 10, 11 things of water anyway, so I'm getting low. Um, but yeah, thank God I have cash envelopes. Now the only thing is I only have twenty five dollars in groceries for my cash envelopes, and I have a hundred and seven dollars of the kids' money, and I have two twenty four of my money. I have twenty five dollars left for household. Um, three dollars left for eating out. No fun money whatsoever. I got twenty five dollars for gas. We gotta stop and get gas too. I need to fill up. Um, and other than that, I don't have no money. So, you know, I have money. Let Let's get the cause. And you be like, yeah, you broke this. We in quarantine. No, I have money, but it's strictly for the this emergency, and it's not to be touched unless we are or. Unless we're having a crucial, 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 crucial moment and we have to touch it. Other than that, right now we're stocked on food. We're stocked on water. We're stocked on everything we need. It's just, yeah. Yo. I'm, part of me is scared, but part of me knows that God has me. 
And that's why I've been juicing and stuff a lot too. Because I'm trying to keep my immune system up by doing my juices and stuff. And getting my vegetables in and things like that. Um, and I noticed when I stopped juicing. Bad enough it's that time of the month. But when I stopped juicing I started breaking out really bad too. So that's another reason I'm getting back to my juicing. So, and plus when I was juicing, my, my tattoo healed like super quick. Like I got this tattoo on a Saturday, Saturday or Sunday. And my tattoo was healed by Thursday. Like it was peeling, it was healed, everything. So I noticed when I juice, if I hurt myself, I heal faster. So I'm back juicing. But yeah, I'm going to get up, throw on a sweater because she's not going to no grocery store like this. I could probably wear my workout pants I have on and my Nike slides, but I need to put on a shirt shirt. So I'm going to do that, wake my daughter up, and then we're going to head out and go to this grocery store. And I will see you guys. No, you know what? I'll probably just put on a little jacket because it's 54 degrees out. That way I ain't got to put on no extra shirt and be overly hot. And then I'll be back. So I'll see you guys as soon as I get in the car. Oh, look at that skin, though. Even though she ain't been juicing how she's supposed to, that skin still clear. She's still glowing. Peace. Okay, just make sure it's stable. There. Okay, y'all. So we went to a $1 tree. It was a bust. She claimed that didn't know trucks coming in, but I'm looking at a big old pallet of stuff. There wasn't there when we went yesterday. So, okay. I'll let you tell me that lie. But I'm looking at the palette. But the only reason I ain't tripped because the palette didn't have nothing that I wanted. It was like gardening stuff and other type of stuff that we didn't need. I'm looking for hand sanitizer and um, bleach because we ain't never had too much bleach. I know y'all talking about lifestyle, lifestyle. I'm a bleach girl. I, you want a clean house? Bleach. You want to clear, kill bacteria? Sit your ass on some bleach and take a bath. Hey, why are you from Milton sitting in bleach? Boy, I will beat you up today. Today is your day to get beat up. Now, would I have been wrong if I would have beat him up? Nah, but you just, just keep paying attention to the road because he wasn't paying attention. I know, because you know I would beat them up, Audrey. So, but yeah, I'm not promoting nobody bathing in no bleach. But I know when I was coming up, a cap full, cap full of bleach is in your water to bathe. You came out clean. You felt clean. Wasn't no wing worms and all that going on. Wasn't no water. She was clean. All the germs was gone. Wasn't no yeast infections. Because your coochie was clean. No, I'm just saying when you sit in the water. <laughs> When you sit in the water, like when you sit in the water, your body is absorbing that. And I know most people are like, that's so harmful. No, it ain't bad. My grandma grew up on it and we was just fine. Y'all need to, that's our problem. Y'all done started deterring from these old school remedies and now y'all feel like the old school way ain't good enough. Baby, the old school way is what kept me, kept me alive, honey. Nigga, you mean to tell me all this time you can't drive? Oh, oh yeah, let me hear it. get what we need so I can get in the house. That's the only time I find peace. Oh, and today I'm gonna bring out the Monopoly board. Me and Lorette played Connect for a Hungry Hippo yesterday. So today I'm gonna bring out the Monopoly board and I'm gonna have 10 minutes on the porch. 10 minutes. Because if you don't go smell some fresh air, you will go crazy. She is the type of person, if she don't sit on the porch, she get, or I mean, if she don't move and shake, she gets sad. So, 10 minutes on the porch will brighten her day. And another thing that's going to help y'all is, oh, y'all, they have blinds. Like, my blinds, I love walking into my room and it's bright and it's got light in it. Open your blinds. Don't be sitting there with your blinds closed and your curtains closed. But the, 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 the corona can't get through the blinds, okay? turn to granules because you playing in these streets we out here trying to drive and you out here 
give him no brown stuff because I don't know how he act on that brown and I know brown make you climb. That white will get you right. So, we had the white. So, I don't need him in that tripping with me on no <laughs> green one. <laughs> oh, Jesus, my brother in town. That's a whole different story, y'all. Let's just say it's good to see that he is happy and healthy. And that I love him. He's my baby, but my baby is ignorant. So, that's that on that. Because I don't need nobody coming for my brother. Because I'm the only one that can come for him. Audrey's getting paid for these services. Audrey really did not want to ride with her mama today. But her services have been paid for. So, this is a job for Audrey. Did you? You look so miserable. <laughs> she looks so miserable. Cause before all this Corona stuff came about, she had plans. Honey, I had plans. Do you understand me? I had a life before this. Okay, and that's that I don't got no life now. But I had things to do for the weekend, and she had things to do for the weekend, and our plans have been altered. So now it's more all about being safe and staying healthy so well I had a good breakfast this morning though I had turkey bacon, grits wheat toast and now I'm drinking this juice oh, oh y'all seen it I shot it to y'all early but child 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 it was good ooh all the people at Chick-fil-A no girl look no wait is it a bunch of people at Chick-fil-A Chicken fillet. All these people that came to work and these people ain't eating out. Girl. Okay, I see like two or three people in line. That's it. Chicken fillet normally be packed back to back like a Drake song. Anybody know damn chicken fillet this time? People not trying to eat out and do nothing right now. You got people that's taking this shit real seriously. As they should. And then you got people playing with it. Them gonna be the people that get people infected. They, uh, they think it's a game. Yeah, it's in this video on Instagram. He talking, so they talking about something. It's, uh, it's, what's it called? It's a uh, bedtime or something like that or something like that. We in Baltimore. It ain't no bedtime, no Kirk he for us. Oh, he was mad about that, huh? <laughs> yeah. He was outside walking in the streets with his gang. Okay. Let's park right here. This is really close. Let's just lay this mask on. She better put a mask on. Oh, right here, girl. Is she leaving? She could have left earlier. I'm freaking hungry. Stop playing with me, little lady. You hungry? Girl, you better get home and uh, cook. I mean, get her. She looked at me like I wasn't supposed to go. Yes, I was. You supposed to walk faster. Looking like the damn. Look at that. Good morning, guys. I am so sorry that I did not come back yesterday. After we came back from the store, what did I do? I didn't do nothing. Okay, so we played a board game. And if you um, follow me on Instagram, then you've seen that. Instagram, I always get everything first. <clears throat> Just because it's quicker to upload there versus having to come here and edit and all that. And then I went live on YouTube for the first time yesterday. And other than that, we didn't do anything. So now it is Sunday. And I'm sitting in my house. Trying to decide if I'm gonna make breakfast or not, cause I'm I don't want to do nothing, especially since I'm gonna cook dinner tonight. So I really don't want to do nothing. So I'm just sitting here trying to figure out what I'm gonna do with my life. <sighs> Y'all, this Corona mess. I'm ready for it to go. I'm just ready to get back to normal. Not that I really be doing anything anyway, but. I want the option to be able to do stuff. So, I've been sleeping with my little sparkles. This is the little teddy bear my daughter gave me. Yeah, it's my big grown behind still sleeps with a teddy bear. So, you're probably saying, but you got your husband. Okay, two big people cannot, lay like, cuddle under each other. It's too hot. The house can be freezing, but because you're two big people, it's hot. I don't know. 
good night i'll see you in the morning stay on your side so i normally cuddle with my little bear <sighs> but yeah i'm gonna get up i'm gonna lay in my bed probably for a few more minutes and get up and fix something to eat because i have to start these oxtails i'm making oxtails macaroni and cheese and i don't know what else probably some steamed broccoli and i gotta detox my face again so yeah i hope you guys are staying safe i hope you guys are okay um like i said we're not really doing nothing there's really nothing to do we're in the house um so i might take y'all along as i go throughout the house and do stuff that needs to be done like seasoning the oxtails getting them started and stuff like that but there's really nothing for me to do so yeah all right guys as soon as i get up and get myself together i will see you guys hey y'all so it is almost eight o'clock i'm having this major headache part in part because that time of the month is ending i have a headache when it starts i have a headache when it ends so i'm having a major migraine and I just took a Tylenol 3, so hopefully that'll help. I am bored out of my mind. There's really nothing to do but eat and sleep. That's all I've been doing since we started this quarantine. Eat and sleep. That's it. That's all I'm doing. And I'm tired. I'm going gonna, I'm, I'm so, I'm gonna to be so happy to go to work tomorrow. I'm not going to know what to do. Don't worry, I got my bleach ready because I'm going to bleach everything down before I sit down. Do you understand me? <sighs> it's just a lot. So now I'm watching the rest of Real Housewives of Atlanta. And then I'm going to hop in the shower. And maybe me and hubby can give massages to each other. Because my head is pounding. Y'all, this breakout is real. My skin is not playing fair at all. Yo, that's, that's the only thing I miss about the shot. I wasn't having these breakouts. I didn't have breakouts because I didn't have periods. But I guess it's natural. I know I've lost some weight since being off of the shot. Um, I know. Sunday was my relaxed day, but I know Monday when I come home, I'm gonna get back to working out. I might as well. I'm not doing nothing else. Might as well work out, work off some of this food that I've been eating. And then they decided they wanted chopped chicken barbecue sandwiches, so I'm gonna make that again. Um, tonight I made oxtails. I made me a little red salmon. I made my daughter and my husband oxtails. So they had that and I did macaroni and cheese and rice because we could use the gravy from the oxtail. So that's what I did with that. And I need to pack a lunch for tomorrow because I don't have anything for lunch tomorrow. Oh, well, wait. I do have two TV dinners at work already, so I might not need nothing. So I might just pack me an orange, some chips. A rice crispy treat and a juice because I'm juicing and I got to pack my big bubble so I'll do that but other than that yeah all right y'all let me try to go do something productive before it's time for me to go to sleep because now I have to take a sleeping pill because I came in here and laid down at five o'clock and woke up at seven so now it's gonna be hard for me to go back to sleep so I'm gonna take a sleeping pill in order to go to sleep which is the unison the melatonin melatonin so it's not addictive or anything so yeah i'm gonna get out of here i'm sorry i didn't come back i just was not feeling good y'all and we weren't doing nothing no way so we tried to play jingle but we couldn't find the game for a while so i thought i wasn't even worried about that and now it's like i don't want to do nothing but take a shower pack my lunch for tomorrow and go to bed that's it so I'll see you guys probably tomorrow. I'll show you how I make the chopped chicken sandwiches. Peace. Okay, y'all. So I made it to work. I am at work doing my job. <sighs> I 
Yeah. The energy that I had this morning when I pulled up to this job, I didn't have that same energy, child.